Sean Van Santen has shaved his head every second year since 2014 for Bluey Day. He does it to raise money and honor a friend and his grandfather who he lost to cancer. And I know lots of family and friends have suffered in that area as well too, so I figured it'd be a good way to show some support and in their memory. The 22nd annual Bluey Day has already raised over $25,000 towards the Fort St. John's Community Cancer Center, Diagnostic Imaging, Surgical Department and Laboratory. Sean's goal was to raise $1,500 for a new CT scanner. He has already surpassed it with a month of fundraising left. But I'd like to keep going and get as much as I can. It's the most he has raised in any of the four years he has participated. I was kind of surprised with COVID. I figured there wouldn't be as many donations going on. So, But my family and friends have rallied up pretty good. Sean wasn't able to join in on Bluey Day last year due to the pandemic. So his hair has been growing for two years. Measuring 16 inches, Sean is hoping his locks will be used to make a difference in other people's lives. I believe if my hair is long enough, I can send it in and, and wigs can get made out of it for people who actually need it. So that's, that makes me feel good. Everyone growing their hair out for Bluey Day is scheduled to get a cut on May 15th. Montana Getty, CJDC TV News, Dawson Creek. Salon and barber services provided by Skinnovations. Be swept away to a world of peace and tranquility at Skinnovations Salon and Day Spa.